Eddie Brock, listen to me! Eddie! This... this isn't you! No! Joyce! Eddie! You're not a killer anymore! Don't you get it? You're not in your right mind! trying to tell myself that I'm just jealous of Walker Sloan's progress. It was only five years ago that he first showed up at Alchemax talking about harnessing energy from the fourth dimension. Now he won't stop until he's running the place. I know his type. He's thinking beyond Alchemax, aiming towards who knows what. He's the exact type of corporate monster I've sworn to rein in. Especially if he's mucking with time travel. The year 2099 might not be much, but it's all mine. And he's not going to change it. He's been siphoning Alchemax resources into converting the gateway in the old virtual unreality lab into something else. Something dangerous. I've tried talking to him, but he's got no time for Miguel O'Hara. But people make time for Spider-Man. Just use the convenient access to the ventilation system to get inside, and then Walker and I can have a little chat. Sloan's up to, I've got to shut it down before he gets in over his head and drags everyone and everything down with him. See, they've been keeping busy in the cybernetics division. Well, it's a lot of shocking robots down there. During the day, as Miguel O'Hara, Alchemax geneticist, I could have walked right in. But at night, the security protocols kick in. The genetics lab. Without that department, I wouldn't be the man I am today. Sloan's 
got to be around here somewhere. I just know it. You'd think the largest tech developer in the world could afford to carpet their air ducts for extra comfort. Assistant online. How may I serve you, Mr. Sloan? Hello, Joseph. Run a final check and initiate security bioscans. Preparing systems, Mr. Sloan. This won't take long. Bioscan sequence initiated. Access to time research lab granted, Mr. Sloan. Slow down, Miguel. Take your time. Don't want to get caught here. Alchemax should be thanking me. Stark Fujikawa Industries is going to take over this entire corporation. Unless someone steps up to prevent it. You're the only one who thinks outside the box enough to do it, sir. Yes, Joseph, I know. I knew he was up to something. so long to come up with it. I simply go back in time and launch Alchemax years before it was originally founded. Not only can I remake Alchemax in my image, but you can dismantle Stark Fujikawa before it gets started. You're a genius, sir. I programmed you well, Joseph. Get away from me that easily. Of course, the CEO will want me to have that degree of power. He's all about power, but he won't have anything to say about it by the time I'm done. for his time research lab, all right. There's an access point near the generator. almost fully charged and I don't have a clue how to shut it down. The only chance is to get to the lab before it's too late. If I don't get there in time, 
He could actually pull this off, go into the past and tamper with who knows what. the only newspaper man in the city that realizes what a menace that webhead is? Oh, uh, Jonah, um, indoor voice, okay? I'm trying to get Mary Jane on the phone. People lionizing that freak. Next thing you know, there'll be a musical about him with a chorus line of dancing Spider-Man. I'd pay to see that. Oh, Mary Jane, hi. see a show. Uh, MJ, I, I would love to, but I'm working with Dr. Octavius in the genetics lab on a DNA project. I had to download a sample of my own DNA into the permanent Alchemax genetic files. I'm still waiting for some test results. Permanent files, huh? Great, so a hundred years from now we can clone you. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Well, how about I come there and we grab a late dinner afterward, okay, Tiger? Yeah, sure, it's okay. Anything for you, babe. And I love when you call me Tiger. It's like a blast from the past. He did it. That lunatic actually did it. And I saw it all. Intruder in time research lab. Maximum force can be used. Get the shock out of my way. They are great. Robot sentries. I'm not sure I can take them right now. Maybe I can draw him off. Move fast enough to distract him with some decoys.
Peter. Peter Parker. Who's that? Who's talking? Miguel O'Hara, the Spider-Man from 2099. Are, are the other me's in my head, too? No. It's just me and you, old-timer. I threw together a chronal link program using a sample of your DNA. It's allowing me to communicate with you at the point in time it was taken. I just wish it was from earlier on. We have almost no time. Time until what? Until you're killed. Un until I'm what now? Because it kind of sounded like you said kill. Listen, a lunatic named Walker Sloan from 2099 created a time gateway. It was a one-way trip that dumped him sometime in the 1970s. He then used his advanced knowledge to build Alchemax, years before it was supposed to be established, transforming your world and mine. But I work for Alchemax. You're saying that's somehow wrong? Completely. At this point in time, you earn a living taking news pictures for J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> the, the late night ranting TV news guy? <laughs> forget it. You can't forget it. Where does this so-called death happen? Sloan's building another gateway on the 66th floor so he can finally travel back and forth. I saw you being killed right there. By who? I couldn't make it out. It doesn't matter. Get out of the building. So a crazed killer can wander around the building without me to stop him? No way. Besides, if I find this guy somewhere else, then I'm invincible. Because I can only die at the gateway, right? It's not an exact science, Parker. Meaning what? You want to spend an hour getting a crash course on temporal physics? No? Then do what I say. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn about priorities, pal. I'm gonna do what I think is right. And that means going after bad guys. You want a Spider-Man who'll do whatever you want? Go play a video game. What was that? Spider sense. <laughs> Save yourself. Eddie Brock? Anti-Venom? He's the one gunning for me? But he's reformed. Hostile intruder detected in Sector AC-78. I've got the intruder sight. Are there teleporting guards in? That's spiffy new tech. All employees, we are in a state of heightened security. We apologize for any inconvenience or possible loss of life. Thank you. Wait, what did you say? I can't hear you. We need to work out the kinks of this time travel communications thing if it's gonna have any hope of catching on. Parker, focus on what's important. I am, which is why I'm heading up to the 66th floor. If that's where we're supposed to butt heads, maybe I could draw them out en route. I'm gonna go look for an elevator. Do you want to die? Of course not. I want to run away even less. That's over with. I'm in just changed into a closet. Huh. Rock just tried to kill me with an elevator. Weird coincidence. Maybe not. Wait, 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 what? Something I did here had an effect on you in 2099? That's impossible. Well, theoretically, it's not. The idea is called quantum causality. The two gateways created a link between our times. Like a wormhole through the fourth dimension. 
Right. Normally changing the past just creates an alternate timeline. But thanks to the wormhole, what you do there affects my time, and vice versa. So I can change things here, now, that can immediately change things in the future? That's amazing.